let's get very fit. Who says you have to go south to learn spicy Latin dance? Latin dance in Barrie is on the rise and even more people are learning how to move to this salsa beat. Let's go see what they're saying. Why do people want to learn Latin? I mean, we're in Barrie. Why do people want to learn Latin dance? It's the energy. For me, it has started as this energy that you feel when you're, when the music is pumping and that you're having this connection with another person who you know you haven't met before, and you share this minute or two during the song together, and then the ne another person the next song, and you kind of grow as a person. And as you grow, the community around you grows. We we go dancing Friday nights, and it's more than a class, right? It's like a, it's it's. It's a group of friends. I love it. Uh, the people are very nice here. Yeah, I make new friends here, and uh, it's uh, it's fun. Why people want to dance? I imagine it's the same thing. It's actually a way of connection and liberation. It's like kids play, play all the time, and adults forget to do things for their you know emotional well-being, right? And and so dancing is like playing, and uh, it feels great. Can anybody dance? So Absolutely. The trick is to relax. If you think of salsa as a, as a technical thing, um, it's going to be much harder to, to break this barrier because, I mean, your mind begins the process and your body follows. I would, uh, I would really love to learn. Would you teach me a fundamental step? Yeah, for sure. We're going to start and learn some basics. Okay. okay. So this is called an open position. So me being the leader in this case, I have my arms open. You relax all of your weight onto my hands. Okay, so here we go into basics. I'm gonna go forward, you're gonna step back. Okay, here we go. And one, two, three, yes, five, six, seven. And one, two, three, and five, six, seven. Well done, one, two, three, and five, six, seven. One, two, three. Five, six, seven. This is called a basic step. Okay. okay. So you'll notice that there's no four when we dance. So the four is an actual pause. Oh, okay. That's why we don't count there was, it. A, yeah. there was a missing number. There yeah. Was a missing number. <laughs> so, so do I need special shoes? Are these okay? Like I'm wearing heels because I'm used to dancing on heels. But there's plenty of people that come into ca in casual shoes, so it really, really doesn't matter. And do we need to bring a partner? You can come without a partner because what we do here is we, if we have odd numbers, then we rotate partners. Okay. Um, so you might be by yourself practicing your step at one moment, but then you'll be back into your rotation. So what else do we need to know? Let's go over a right turn. Okay. Okay, so your cue for a right turn will be my arm up on three. Okay. okay? Here we go. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. Excellent. Let's do one basic, one right turn. Okay. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. Here we go. Two, three, and five, six, seven. Well done. I Thank think you're you. ready for a class. All <laughs> right. Well, I'm looking forward to it. Thanks, Natasha. All right, ready. I'm going to apologize to your feet in advance. Yes. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. One, two, three, and five, six, seven. One, two, three. Oh. She goes <laughs> five. Hot. So hot. So I see it hot. I'm the leader. You are the leader. OK, I let you.
Thanks so much, Natasha, and to Salsa Beef.